Hi everyone, it is day 10 of Ruth's awesome advent calendar and we've tried, decided to change the scenery a little bit and move the camera around today because it is snowing. It's a snowmageddon over here where I live. It's absolutely beautiful outside but there's loads and loads of traffic chaos going on. So if you are in an area where it's snowing a lot, please do take care in the run up to Christmas with your driving or don't drive if you know the weather conditions are gonna be treacherous. So the question is, what is behind door 10 of Ruth's awesome advent calendar? Well, the letter and the word for today is I for inspire. Now, who is it in your life that really inspires you? Who is it that perhaps that inspiration that they give you really motivates you to get things done, or they really act as a great role model for you in your life, whether that's historically or in the present day. Now, I know for me, the person that I find, well, the persons, in fact, that really inspire me as firstly, my mum. She's very stoic. She's always been extremely hardworking parent. She's never really complained about stuff she's not been able to do, what she's perhaps really wanted to do in life because she's had three children to look after. But she's been a real role model for me. She's really inspired me to work hard and do what I'm passionate about and really try not to complain too much. Now the other person for me who really inspires me is my husband Dave because he's such a rock for me. He really helps me maintain that clarity and focus and he doesn't take any nonsense which is excellent he really keeps me grounded so who is it that really inspires you and what is it about that person that is really inspiring what are their attributes what are their qualities that really make them that inspiring person for you secondly what can you do what can you do to take those attributes is there anything that you can do to transfer some of those inspirational attributes into your life to lift yourself up to another level and move yourself forward? What is it that you could take from a learning perspective from those people and really bring that into your daily life? And finally, what could you do to inspire others this Christmas? Is there anything that you could do personally to really help lift someone else? Because we know, for example, that the best way to generate happiness is to give happiness to others. So what could you do this Christmas to try and inspire someone else? Perhaps that's someone closest to you, perhaps it's a friend, or perhaps it's part of your local community. What could you do to inspire others? Now, just to summarise, the letter and the word for today is I, I for inspire. And the question is, who is it in your life that inspires you and why do they have that inspiration for you? What is it about that person that's really inspiring? Secondly, what attributes from them can you take to lift yourself up to another level? And finally, what could you do this festive season to really inspire others, to really lift others and bring some happiness and festive joy to their world? I hope you enjoyed today's session of Ruth's awesome advent calendar and I'm so looking forward to tomorrow. Beautiful scenery outside. I hope it stays snowing for us. I'm looking forward to day 11 of Ruth's awesome advent calendar.